up everybody? This is your boy Montre. Uh, just want to chat with you guys a little bit. How are you doing? I haven't seen you guys in a minute. Um, just cleaning up my room here. Just trying to keep everything nice and balanced. I'm very big on feng shui. I don't know how many guys you are. Cleanliness is next to godliness. And I really find that when I have problems in my life, when I feel like, you know, things are not spiritually right, or I feel like, you know, something just out of balance, I usually look around in my bedroom and I check to see like what's going on you know and usually my room would be kind of cluttery or messy or something so what I'll do is just clean up my room and I don't know how much of change that does but I feel better I feel better after a while and things seem to seem to happen so I don't know look around at your bedroom tell me what does your bedroom say about you that'll be the first question that I have for my video in other news uh, Super Bowl is coming up. Pats against the Pits. So I want to know who do you think is going to win. I'm not too much of a football buff. I don't really keep up that much because so I really need to know just in case I want to put a bet down. So you guys let me know who I should be putting money down on. The Super Bowl is going to be here in Dallas. Big deal because you know there's going to be a lot of parties going on. I'm trying to figure out what party to go to. Now if you're out of town, you're coming in town, be sure to email me. Let me know because uh, I want to know who's going to be in town. Uh, let me, you know, hey, maybe we'll meet up, uh, go to a party if you're paying, and I would love to, you know, uh, he see you, you know, uh, if you're going to be in Dallas, of course. Um, <clears throat> as for me, uh, I don't quite have uh, Super Bowl plans yet. Uh, most likely, I'll be going to a house party. I did have an audition. Deion Sanders was doing a casting call for uh, some party people, for some of his VIP parties, so... Uh, if I get a call back on that, I'll surely let you guys know, and I may even do some videotaping. If not, then uh, I'll just probably just be, you know, hanging out with some friends or whatnot, drinking. That's free, and it's cheap, and it's still more fun than paying $100 going to a party with a bunch of people I don't know. Speaking about Super Bowl, woo, Christina Aguilera, that's my baby mama. She's going to be singing at the, um, the, what, the beginning, the kickoff, at the beginning of the Super Bowl. I don't know what they call it, right? I can't wait to see that. That's I'm a, I, I want to watch it just because of that, you know. I love Christina Aguilera. I think her career is definitely on the move. She's been doing some big things, and uh, she did the movie Burlesque, and her album is awesome. She's got some really good songs on there. So if you haven't heard the Christina Aguilera album, um, I say hey, go to MySpace, check out her page, and you can listen to the whole album for free. That's why I still like MySpace. A lot of people just be just. I don't like MySpace, but hey, I can listen to music free on there, and then if I like it, then I'll buy it, but I don't buy anything until I listen to it first. Her album is great, so if you haven't checked out her album, be sure to check out check out her page on MySpace and listen to her album. And some really sad news, uh, Moscow today was bombed at their airport, and um, a lot of people are scared about terrorists again. Uh, the whole fear of terrorists is back, and a lot of people are getting what you call Islamic phobia. People are who are fearful of Islamic people and I'm not really quick to point fingers when I hear about terrorist action you know first thing that happens when you hear about terrorist things is that people start blaming Muslims for it and not to say that Muslims don't do crazy shit but it's just that you just can't blame just Muslims I mean there's crazy Christians out there hello KKK and you know <laughs> uh, there's crazy people who are not religious who do stuff for whatever odd reason, like we just recently had in Arizona, and that was not a Muslim person at all. So, uh, if it was Muslim people, then that's a sad thing because there are extremists in every religion, but there are crazy people everywhere, and it's just a really sad thing. So, uh, I'm not quick to point blame uh, just because I hear about terrorist action in uh, some something that's really horrible. I think about 30 people. I'm reading it now. Moscow airport explosion. Terrorist attack. I think it was like 30 people died in that explosion, so that's pretty sad. Tell me what you think about that on all the stories that's happened uh, so far at the beginning of the week. It's gonna be a long week because it's already started. <laughs> Tell me what you think about uh, either the terrorist action, the Super Bowl, or uh, cleanliness, your bedroom. There's three things. I gave you three questions, so be sure to hit me up. Thank you for all the people who subscribed to me, uh, who sent me letters uh, to say hi, what's up, and even send me comments. Love ya, mwah, thank you. And this is Montre saying, if you don't do it, then who will? Peace out.